Hello everyone, this is Physics 101. In this lesson, we are go going to learn about electric potential energy. So before we start with electric potential energy, let's briefly recall the gravitational potential energy. So, you have a ground here, and say you have a ball here. So, you know that the gravitational force or the gravitational field G is pointing downwards. So, what will happen is that this ball will experience a force that is downwards. So this force will do a work that is equal to the uh, decrease in potential energy. So as this uh, ball falls down in this for example in this height the gravitational force decreased its potential energy to zero and work is being done a uh, work had been done on the ball so this means that uh, a force gave the ball some energy or transferred some energy in the form of kinetic energy to it. So this uh, same principle happens also in electrical or simply electric potential energy. So imagine if you will a ground composed of negative charges and a ceiling composed of positive charges. So with these positive and negative charges separated in this uh, region, there will be a electric field that will be pointed in this direction. So now if you place a, say, a positive charge here, uh, this positive charge will, will want to move in the direction of the electric field. So it will experience a sort of like gravitational force but now this is electric force that will make it move towards this uh, negative charge. So in doing so uh, the electric force the electric force decreased the electrical potential energy of the positive charge. So that's what happens when you subject a positive charge in this kind of configuration. So, now consider a different scenario. So, you still have the ceiling here and the floor of negative charges. 
and here we have positive charges and our electric field is still pointing from positive to negative now what if to begin with our positive charge is uh, sorry in this configuration so uh, the electric force is actually acting still acting on it in this direction now consider uh, this uh, situation wherein we are to move up this charge towards the positive terminal here so from here we are increasing its uh, increasing we are increasing its electrical potential energy so this doesn't happen naturally you actually have to you you need to have a sort of a device that would increase elastic ah sorry increase uh, electrical potential energy of objects or you need some sort of push so imagine that uh, this is a ball and this is like the, the case in gravitational potential energy you don't observe balls moving naturally upward what we know is that uh, everything naturally goes downward so now it's the same case in this positive charge you need some someone or something to push it towards in this direction so that something is the battery so the battery provides an increase in electrical so it increases the electrical potential energies of this positive charge so what is uh, how do we um, how do we know how much uh, of this battery how much this battery increases the potential electrical potential energy of this charge so the physical quantity assigned to it is the potential difference or simply called the voltage So the voltage or potential difference, uh, let me write it down first. So VA minus VB equals the work done by moving A to B per charge. the work done by the electric force when a unit charge 
cue not moves or is moved it's more proper to say is moved from A to B so how do we know how do we uh, know the voltage of a battery so for example here we have a battery with a positive terminal here and a negative terminal here so our charge lies down here and we want to uh, move it or increase its potential energy uh, in this region from A ah sorry from we want to move it from B to A I think this charge should be placed here there so the voltage from A to B what will happen is that uh, this this electric field set up by the battery will cause a force on this uh, positive charge so now the work done by moving from VA to VB is equal to the energy from A to B over Q0 so what is this work done from A to B so we know that um, work done is associated with a decrease in potential energy here so uh, if this scenario happens, our work done here will be negative. So VA minus VB will become negative del U over Q. So that's the scenario when uh, this positive charge moves from A to B. But we want it so that such that uh, this positive charge moves from this direction to this direction uh, from B to A so in other words we want to increase the potential energy or the electrical potential energy of this positive charge so it's the same thing as moving from BB to VA so this will become now positive del U over Q